Good evening. Thank you for joining us. People in Montezuma will be wearing orange tonight to honor Xavier Harrelson. The missing boy's remains were identified on Friday, and KCCI senior reporter Todd Magel is here with how the town is still hoping for more answers in his death. Todd. Array and Stacy people we talked to are sadly relieved but still uneasy about what happened to Xavier Harrelson. No matter what, they do want to honor him. There's a lot of questions still out there. Montezuma School Principal Kurt Hanna says it's been a tough day. Kids are back in class after learning that Xavier Harrelson is no longer missing. It was, you know, obviously sad, um, but also, you know, some some ability to grieve, um, knowing that he is in a better place. Hannah says school counselors have spent the day helping students deal with the news. Many already assume the remains found a few weeks ago in rural Powshe County were those of Xavier. Now it's official. It's a ton of pressure for kids. Um, you know, I don't want a kiddo going home and thinking they're not safe to, to walk away from school or they're not safe at home. Hannah is asking the town to honor Xavier at Monday night's volleyball game at the school gym. We're asking community and, and players and family members to wear orange just as we want to keep Xavier's memory going. Townspeople say they're glad Xavier is no longer missing, but now they want to know what happened to this once friendly, smiling boy. It's very sad, and then in a way it was sort of a relief because he's no longer missing. Um, just thinking as a parent of two boys, um, I think the not knowing probably would have about killed me. And the DCI says the autopsy on Xavier Harrelson is not complete and there is no official cause of death or a determination if his death is a crime. Rhea. Thank you, Todd. Well, Xavier disappeared back on May 27th. His remains were found in a farm field north of Montezuma four months later on September 30th. The field had not been previously searched by investigators in other than clothing. The Iowa DCI has not said what other evidence may have been recovered where Xavier was found.